All right, here's today's rundown, what we have in our pack. We got some vitamins here to start. This is the Windicator powder. You push that in the air, see where the wind is, you see where the wind is going. So it prevents from animals smelling you. And we got the hydration pack, liquid IV, Bic lighter, a bird flip knife, very good. Um, that is an electric collar. Uh, the remote and we don't use the, the actual electricity shock on it we just use the vibrate and the sound it's for um, dog hunting training there's a paracord and you know that's for everything and this is a, uh, a mosquito repellent machine you click the button it burns smoke out of there so even if you're in one spot it'll keep mosquitoes from biting you and there's the pack I'm gonna lay the camel back in there this should do it for today. We got Remy over there. We're gonna be doing some bird indicating training. Basically pointing out the birds, healing, things like that. Just basic training. He's only seven months. And for the hike, we're gonna be going up this trail and hiking way up into Wohia Forest. Whoa, come. Basically, we're just going to be hiking up to the Ohio Forest. It's a pretty long trail. It's pretty beautiful, so I'll keep the camera rolling and we'll have some fun today. As you can see, Remy's working in air scent right there. He's a hybrid sniffer, so he uses the ground right there. And then he uses the air, what gets picked up. He's familiar with the pheasant scent we, from a pheasant that we harvested, clipping off the wings and giving it to him and letting him track it in the yard. It's just pretty cool to watch him work. Once he picks up that scent, he's gonna be looking for indicating the bird. And it's pretty clear when he gets on a bird, he gets a lot more excited and a lot more focused. Points his tail. So we're gonna see if we have some fun. having a little snack. We got to the top of the mountain. Beautiful avenue to the trees. And those are all the coffee groves with a beautiful ocean view. It's really important to get your dog outside and get him some exercise and try to make it very consistent. Be a happy dog and just have fun with it. Good boy. Pretty incredible stuff. So I'm sitting there and I see Remy. He's getting onto a bird. He's getting excited. So I'm like, okay, let's get the phone out. I'm getting the phone ready. And then he just starts stalking up. The pheasant looks like it's ready to just, you know, evacuate the bushes. And he's going up there like a wolf. The bird jumps out and he just grabs it from the air. It's like we got some wild dogs. So 
So there's wild dogs up here as well. And sometimes they pick up scents on the on the pigs and that's what they eat out here. So there might be a wild dog chasing after a pig. We'll have to find out and be safe. Some of those are pretty vicious. So I went and investigated. Sounds like the wild dogs chased the pig up the mountain. I could hear them, they're nipping at him. I wasn't able to get my camera out. Might have done you guys a favor. It's not the best sound hearing a pig get eaten alive by some wild dogs. But anyways, we're stoked. Remy got his first bird. And I think he's going to be a great hunting dog. So the plan is now we're going to be going to just head down to the house. Got about an hour's hike. And cook up some food. And we'll cook up some food out of the pheasant. And that's what it's all about. you got to use what you hunt. And we don't kill for sport. We just cook the food and provide for others. I'm talking about. Yeah, buddy. All right, so I made a curry, Okinawa sweet potato curry. Give a little bit to Remy. Find us that bird. Mix that up in this food. So, we made a good curry with the pheasant that we caught today. Delicious, savory, and has a unique bird flavor that you wouldn't get from chicken. We got some purple sweet potatoes and carrots, some curry. Makes a really good soup, and that's what it's all about. So delicious.